We you did, in fact, buy another house. When we got the notice on the 22nd, we, of, she texted us a of notice. June? Of July, actually. July 22nd, she texted us the eviction, and literally within days of that, we went down to the mortgage company that we'd been working with and let them know that we were no longer able to Purchase that house. Yeah, so we started looking at houses that day. Are you in a new house? Yes, we uh, put in an offer less than two weeks later and were accepted and provided the down payment and we're moving. How much did you purchase the new house for? The new house was $235,000. So you had more than enough money to put down as a down payment. Mm hmm Okay, Ms. And Todd. You're suing them for putting sliding doors into the garage, cutting down three trees, fire pit, and no grass. Did you put the house up on the market? Yes, the house was put up on the market. On what date? I believe sometime after July 22nd, after I had gotten a response back from Melissa that she stated they would not be buying the house. They wouldn't be buying the house for $175,000. Yes. They would buy it for $135,000, which was your original deal, but they weren't going to pay one seventy-five. dollars They never communicated that. They oh, just said they weren't going to buy it anymore. Just a second. I don't think... You told them that you were changing the terms of the original contract to $175,000. Is that correct? Yes, that is correct. And according to you, that's because you said that was the now going rate for that house. Yes, Your Honor. And when you put it up for sale, what did you put it up for sale for? I put it up for sale for the price of $135 due to the damages that had been caused by show the me. renters. Just a second. I want no, don't show me the damages. I want you to show me the real estate listing where you put it up for $135. $35,000. That's what I want to see. I want to see that. I don't have that. I listed it on like Craigslist at 135. I've taken it down because I had realtors call me. Um, I had a realtor yeah, yeah. write me a list of things that he evaluated the house, and this is what he said the value of it should be. Have you put the house up for sale currently? No, it is sold. It's sold? Yes. To whom and when? It was sold to Steve, a realtor person. And it was sold when? On what date? May I look at my papers? Absolutely. Please. I actually have the paper oh. showing that May date, I have Your Honor. Please. Thank you very much. Shows the date and the amount that it was sold for. Great. Thank you. Your Honor, we also do have a letter with our response to her price increase where we told her that due to the increase, we would no longer be purchasing the home. I'd like to see it. So you sold it immediately, a month later in September, to this guy for one thirty-five five. Seven days after we moved out. I'm sorry, ma'am, no. It was sold on 9-17 of 2018 for the purchase price of one thirty-five five. Due to the damages from what they've done... You didn't lose any money. He didn't lose any money. As a matter of fact, you made an extra 500 bucks. You made an extra $500. You had an agreement to sell them your house for 135. You sold it to Steve for 135.5. No, I'm sorry, it was 135. Not according to this. I have the letter from Steve himself. Whatever, you didn't lose any money. Your case is dismissed. Your now Honor, we're going to deal with your, your counterclaim. Your Honor, I'm sorry, but do our house was worth $175,000 fair market value. I have pictures Just, showing the damage that they li did to careful. this house. Listen to Nothing me, was done right. The stuff that would have come in from Zero. the bank. Zero. Zero. zippity doo -dah. <laughs> You said that you were selling them the house for $135,000. You changed the terms of that to $175,000. You ended up selling the house for one thirty-five, dollars which is exactly what you were supposed to get from them. You suffered no damage. Your case is My damage is dismissed was the property though. lost. Your and it wouldn't have passed dismissed. inspection. Your Honor, now, we are also countersuing her. Yes, I understand. You bought a nice house, probably much nicer. Your counterclaims dismissed too. Good luck. Goodbye. Oh, Thank you. <laughs> I think the plaintiff just felt that we didn't hold up our end, and unfortunately, it wasn't due to us not wanting to. It would have never passed inspection. We wanted that house. We spent two years making that house really our home. Wanted. For them to purchase the price at 135, what they did wasn't professionally done. It was because they weren't going to give us the extra small amount of time we asked for. The house was completely filthy. They never cleaned it. It was gross. Unfortunately, things didn't work out, but we got a much nicer home. <laughs> they had no intent to ever buy it. 